world and just moments Hello and welcome hey, Derek Ray and with me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson and a chance to be world champions Let's hope the game matches the atmosphere. It should be an absolute cracker. I can't wait for this to start. Here's how it looks for Portugal. Rui Patricio stands between the posts. Joao Cancelo starts with Rafael Guerrero as fullbacks. Bernardo Silva plays alongside Bruno Fernandes in central midfield. And leading the attack today is Cristiano Ronaldo. Here's the starting 11 for Sweden. Well, they're also playing in a 4-3-3 formation, but they play it in a slightly different way, particularly in the wide areas, where their fullbacks will get forward and rotate with the wingers at every opportunity. And the match begins. Bruno Fernandes, Ruben Dias, Diogo Jota, Dias, it's with Guerrero, good use of advantage by the referee, it's a promising move from Portugal, able to get a body in the way, and simple for the keeper, And there to intervene. Well, it's been a long and winding road to the final for Portugal. It's worth remembering that they finished second in the qualifying group. They had to go through playoff matches against Turkey and North Macedonia just to get to the 2022 finals. And this past month has been challenging as well. But they're here and they have a well-earned track record as winners. Well, you're absolutely right. But I think they've got better and better as the tournament has worn on. They've got a great understanding of what's required of each player on the pitch. They're good tactically, they've been fit, and I think they've got every chance of being the world champions here, but they're going to have to play well. Given his magnificent form, then there's every reason to believe that Cristiano Ronaldo will make an impact here. Well, Derek, when he's on form, when he's focused, he's a brilliant runner with the ball. He can take on players, he can go past people with ease, and he's got a great shot on him as well. I'm really looking forward to watching him play today. Shot's up. On to Bruno Fernandes. Well, the supporters think it's on. Ronaldo! And there it is! Living history! The opening goal of the 2022 World Cup Final. Incredible celebrations. Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease. And it's just a change of pace. But there's still plenty for him to do. Under all sorts of pressure from the defender, he's just able to keep him at bay and finishes with a plum. It's a great goal. So underway again here, 1 0 the score. That's a well struck pass. Ekdal. And they need to get tighter here. Ibrahimovic. Oh, good save.
And now the delivery. Not the result from the set piece they were looking for. And he takes it on! Well, it turns out to be fairly routine for the keeper in the end. And intercepts again. Good effort here! No oh, strong hand on the ball. Could play it in. And a textbook interception. Well, what a great save that was to keep them in this. May just be the impetus they need, as they certainly haven't been at their best today. Well, that's how to hit them. Not quite accurate enough, though. Well, what a goal that would have been. Surprised he took it on, to be honest. Long way out, but oh, so close. Portugal pushing forward with options available. But nothing comes of it. Augustinsson. And it's with Ekdal. And that'll be a Portugal throw. Ekdal. Ibrahimovic. Well, far from the ideal pass. Well, good vision. And he might be in here. And he clears it out of harm's way. Zlatan Ibrahimovic. And he did well to cut it out. That's a splendid ball from Ronaldo. And up for grabs off the keeper. Ronaldo Silva. Oh, he saved it well. And he's fired over the corner. Well, as a defender, that will sit you down to the ground. He'll have a go here. No oh, keeper in control. Played over. And the problem not completely solved. Not a time for composure on the ball. Now the managers will now deliver their half-time team talk. So back underway here into the second half. A chance to whip it in. A concession of a corner here. Trying to deliver it accurately. And under pressure, that was a fine claim. Well, they've won the ball back quickly. And that was simply miles off target. Well, I think he's right to go for power, but he's made the wrong connection, and it's really poor technique in the end. Now they're going to alter things. Here's the substitution. Ruben Neves. On to Silva. Guerrero. Ronaldo. Oh, yes! What a classy goal! And make no mistake, there aren't many in the game who would have the confidence to even try it. Well, here it is again, and all you can do is admire the skill. That's a really clever goal, you have to say. So, 
back underway with the scoreline standing at 2-0. A lot of bad plan of action, but through to the goalkeeper it goes. And a throw in for Sweden. And good use of advantage. Could pull one back here. Top class defending. And the counter looks on here. Options available. Giving it a try. Oh, the crossbar is still reverberating. Cleared away. Well, I have to say, I thought that looked to be going in. It was such a good effort. Considerable momentum, courtesy of Ronaldo. But what can he produce from here? Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Well, Portugal had more of the possession, as you can see, and they've made good use of it. They really have played some good attacking football, and they look like scoring more. And a substitution in the offing. And it's with Izak. And now with Kulusevski. The referee knew that was foul play, but advantage it is. Oh, surely! Marvellous anticipation! It is a decent looking attack here. And let's give credit to the defending. Ronaldo, and with that, the attack fizzles out. Just 20 minutes remaining now. That's a fairly easy save for any keeper to make. Joao Cancelo. Here's Ronaldo. And continues his run, but nothing comes of it. Terrific ball from Ibrahimovic. But hang on, offside is the verdict here. It's not going to stand. Well, you can tell he thought he was onside here, but the assistant, I think, got it absolutely right. Svanberg. That's a well-timed pass. Oh dear, oh dear. He went for placement, but a really tame effort, you have to say. Nicely cut out. Ronaldo threading it through. Can he keep his composure? There it is! Victory more or less guaranteed now. Well, let's just take another look at this through ball by Ronaldo. He gets the timing absolutely right, and his movement's so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one thought in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. It's a massive lead, and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now. Well, diving magnificently to make sure he got there. 
prompt defensive action called for. Svanberg. And we will have a couple of additional minutes at the end here. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? Well, he knew he had to get to the ball, and he did. And now it's all over! We've witnessed history! Portugal have won the World Cup for the first time! Well, they've been kings of Europe, now they're kings of the world. And I have to say, Derek, they fully deserved it. They were great today. Portugal, the world champions! And this is finally Portugal's time, fully deserved, best team in the world. Well, you have to give.